We've been working on it for the last several years with NASA and working with the FAA to get these, these delivery drones approved. And we've got Zipline and Amazon is starting to deliver in some beta areas. And you know, one of the biggest challenges we had at NASA was number one, safety in the airspace, but then also visual and noise pollution. And I mean, you heard just one helicopter fly by, how noisy that is, right? And, and you start getting hundreds or thousands of drones buzzing around at low altitude. They call it the low altitude economy. Basically, most aircraft, they fly 500 feet and above. In fact, legally, they're not allowed to fly below 400 or below 500 feet unless they're taking off or landing. So they're legally, they have to stay above that. Drones, we're not allowed to fly above 400 feet. So we have this nice little 100 foot safety buffer that keeps us there. But this low altitude economy is going to encompass all the deliveries and all the drones and all the, all the stuff that's going on, the surveying, the security, the you know, the, everything that's going on with the drones from power washing buildings to putting out fires to anything and everything in between.